So, uh, so what are you making? A surprise for Terry. She's been bugging me. I mean, she's been asking me <laughs> nice to uh, make creamsicle uh, bark using uh, orange hard candy pieces of crushed up in white chocolate. Sounds pretty good. So, is she gonna eat it all? <laughs> so I'm gonna it's surprise all for her. her. <laughs> So this is the leftover hard candy that we made with uh, Greg, right? Yeah, yeah, and we crushed it up. Well, actually, you crushed it up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember <laughs> that. <laughs> Taking your aggressions out. <laughs> yeah, I loved how, you know, Terry came down. She's like, I was wondering what all that noise was, you know? Hammering well, away. You can hear that up there, can you? <laughs> yeah. As you're hammering, I'm going, no, no! <laughs> Hey man, I gotta work out those aggressions somewhere. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Use the rubber mallet, that'll work great. Sure. So we'll try this out, huh? All yeah. Right. I don't know, it sounds really good. Are they small enough pieces? Hope so. Okay. Okay, ready? Here we go, huh? That looks good. Yeah? Alright. Yeah. <laughs> it gets pretty powdery towards the bottom, so. <laughs> yeah, that's I'll get some of that. This will surprise her. And tomorrow's her birthday. It's going to be 39 again. <laughs> what do you mean again? I mean... <laughs> hmm. Alright. So you're just trying to get a nice little layer down? Yeah. Good fruit? And we'll just put the chocolate on top. So if you do this at home, you can do... You can make bark with anything you want. Hmm. Just get some wax paper. Do uh, raisins, uh, peanuts, uh, <laughs> candy, <laughs> like this. <laughs> Use your imagination. And then if you make it, make sure you send a video to us so we can see it. And we'll post it. So does Terry just like really like uh, creamsicles? Is that her thing? I don't know, she just thought it would be a, a good idea. I like creamsicle. Oh yeah. Yeah, I guess I guess I don't really know anybody who doesn't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so. I mean we make at Christmas time we do uh, peppermint hard candies crushed up and then we do, and then we had Oreo cookies to it too. Mm. So that's I miss that. that's pretty yummy. But this was this was you know, surprise Terry on her birthday that I finally made it. <laughs> yeah, she's pretty hard to get presents for too, huh? <laughs> I know yeah, that's she's trouble. got everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty quick. <laughs> so, do you think any of this will make it to the website, or is this uh, just an experiment? Well, yeah, Terry's gonna. She'll probably put it on there, and then we'll see how, see if people like it or not. And then, uh, if people like it, well, then we'll add it to the making. Yeah. The production list. Cool. Yeah, so we'll see. We'll just use this as a little experiment. Well, I hope it comes out good because it it looks real good. Yeah. Yeah. It's like one of those things where I can taste it already. Yeah, I know it. Do 
I'm just trying to get like a nice even layer, right? Yeah, make it nice and thin as I can. It's easier to eat. Although, people don't mind a nice big thick piece of candy, I guess, <laughs> huh? <laughs> nice thick piece of chocolate. Yeah, I'm sure they do. <laughs> I wonder if my camera works as steady as Craig's. So how can you tell it needs a little more chocolate? Well, I just want the right thickness. I want like a quarter inch. Oh, okay. Try to... So, so otherwise, if it's too thin, it breaks too easy. Hmm. So you just saw a couple of pockets Give it in there. A little more body. Yeah. Let's throw a little on here. <laughs> All right. I like to leave it on top, but that would look really nice, except for it will get sticky. Yeah. So you can't. You got to make sure it's covered up. Yeah, it still looks. But it if you still make looks it at nice home and you uh, just make a small amount. Then you're going to eat it within a couple days. Then you can leave it on top as a decoration. That looks nice. Hmm. Maybe that could be another topping. Crushed hard candy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we need more toppings. Yeah. More sprinkleables. So what's the padding for? This is to make sure I push it when I'm pushing down the chocolate into the candy, just in case there's uh, bare spots on the bottom of the candy. This will push down the candy right into the chocolate. And the chocolate will go completely cover it. Because sometimes that can happen. It might be a bare spot. But if you push it down, put it as you're padding, you probably won't get any more spots. Hmm. I'll learn that over time. Yeah, it seems like something that you can't know before your first time, you know? So you go to flip it over or something. Yep. Then you flip it over and you go, oh, <laughs> I should have padded it harder. Yep, just push it in. Push the candy right, right around. I thought you always told me not to pat the chocolate. Yeah, that's right. Stop You're sending patting the chocolate. Mixed messages over here, man. <laughs> Does your arm ever get tired? No. <laughs> never. <laughs> Which way to the beach? <laughs> tired? What's that mean? I think it's the other one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the beach Shirley season's over. Almost... <laughs> Don't call me Shirley. Yeah. I'm serious. Don't call me Shirley. <laughs> Do you have the rest of those too? Yeah, that's the naked gun, right? Oh yeah. 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 They're great. We have another movie day. Sewage. That one, he, was, he, he got dropped in the sewage and he, he uh, had a um, uh, scuba diving outfit on. <laughs> he's, he's like, sewage, I love it. <laughs> this is some lovely filth. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't vote for you. <laughs> I thought I was an emperor just because some watery tart threw a scimitar at me. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I love that part too where like he gets out of the car or something and doesn't put it in park and it starts running off and he's like, who's in that oh, car? Yeah, he's going, yeah, his own car's going down the hill. Yeah. And he's shooting at it. <laughs> and blows up as it turns a corner, you know? 
Okay, now the creamsicle bark is ready. It's almost dry. You gotta let it almost dry so you can cut it. If you if you try to do it too soon, the hard candy will um, be pushed around on the candy and just make big marks, and we don't want that. So this get this way you can cut right through the hard candy. Terry will be surprised. I finally made this. And it's, a, and it's her birthday. So we're going to cook out tomorrow. That'll be fun. And the dragon car will come over. We'll hang out. Another big piece. Oh, but the big pieces. And that's it. So now we'll let that completely dry more. It'll take uh, a couple hours before I can pick it up and then we'll box it up and seal it up and be ready to go. Happy birthday to you. What? Uh, Happy birthday, birthday <laughs> to you. I'm afraid to look. Happy birthday, come dear Terry. Surprised you haven't come to your ears yet. Happy birthday <laughs> to, to you. Oh, look at it. It's a box of... Jeff. Jeff. Some, something you always wanted. Care to tell? No. <laughs> Does it have anything to do with unicorns? I like unicorns, yeah. Do they exist? Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. What do you think is in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? I believe this is something I've always wanted. Thank you. Is this for my birthday? Kinda. Yeah, this is better than cake. What gave you that impression? It's like it's like a creamsicle bark. I don't think we can call it creamsicle though, so mm -hmm, trademark. Yeah, that little TM it was there. I'm just yeah. that says like creamsicle bark. Mm -hmm. Okay, remember we made the image candy that Greg from Lucky Pursuits showed us, but we had some chunks of orange left over. I have been bagging for two or three years for <laughs> white chocolate bark with crushed candy canes. Well, we got ourselves some crushed orange candy. It didn't have to be a candy cane first. It's okay if it was image candy first. So yeah, what do you think of that? Yeah, That's it looks pretty. so good, you could probably sell it to people. Do you think people would buy it? I think it's pretty neat. We'll try it out. And if they don't like it, well, give it away to kids on Halloween. Trick or treaters. Yeah, <laughs> here you go kid, enjoy. Yeah.